In the Buckeye Garage, take one. Yeah. Today, the ups man came to my house, dropped off some packages. I was going to do on a porch. Uh, well, let's just do in the Buckeye Garage. So, pick up one of these here packages. Oh, open it up. See what we got here. I'm pretty sure none of this will amaze or baffle you, but what the heck, right? Big bubble wrap. I've always wanted some of this. Finally, I have some. Okay, it's, uh, that's all up there. You'd like to make sure it says thank you for your yeah, yeah, bye, yeah. Uh, in the envelope. Uh, this is ordered from Dennis Kirk. DennisKirk.com. Uh, if you got the stuff, it's not right. They always put a return label in an envelope, send it back, don't so worry about it. But this is a couple things I got here. Go ahead and open them up here and let you, let you check them out. Somebody walked through. But this is a uh, close up here. A professional chain kit. This is you know this is professional. So you know, uh, no navy. You would never be able to handle this professional chain kit. But, uh, yeah, open it up here. That is a front sprocket. And I don't want it. Actually, what it was is uh, you know that Keith kind of destroyed his sprockets, so he put bigger ones on it. Hopefully, these uh, will fit back on his Rebel, so he can get the right gear ratio back that he needs. But anyway. I was going to, uh, I need a, uh, a I need a new chain for my Rebel. So, I uh, bought a new chain. And uh, I just happened to notice Ooh, is that another sticker on you? Oh, yeah, another sticker put on the door at the clubhouse. 
But anyway, ooh, my lady, look at here, look at here. Even another sticker to put on the door of the clubhouse. But, uh, and there's, to put the thing together, the master links. The master link. But, uh, yeah, got me a new chain. It's, uh, ooh, breezy. Anyway, I'm going to get a breezy. This is the uh, stock chain for the Rebel. Uh, one thing I like about the stock chain, the uh, Rebel, which is this over here, it, uh, kind of wore its chain out a little bit while well, I need a, a new one. And uh, but when I ordered the chain, I noticed this kit. And I know that Keith needs new sprockets. But I could get this kit for five bucks more than just the chain. But now if you try to buy the, the sprocket separately, it's going to cost you some money. I just happened to run across this kit where they had a nice little sale and they said, you know, the chain, sprockets, the whole nine yards were only $5 more than it cost for just the chain. So I thought, Keith needs the sprockets, I'm getting them. So I got that for Keith. That's going to help me out on the polar bear run when I start driving to the polar bear. And here's another little package that was delivered. Uh, let's see if we can't get it open here. what it might be. Yeah. Well, I hope there's more decals. I love decals. Okay. There we go. Now, actually, that there, the new windshield, with the uh, blaring for the throttle in this, the, you know, your bars. That way, keep the wind from blowing on me. And uh, everything to put it together right there. Got that. It's talking to the box. So here's the uh, same thing. Right, gives you the thing. It's your own. Send her back. So we'll go ahead and see if we can't put this on. See what we come up with. Okay. Okay, this is the Rebel before. We'll put the thing on, give you an after. I almost forgot the after, but it's so clear and clean that it's probably hard for anyone to see. But uh, it's on there. It's on there. Now, with the uh, flaring that I got, you know, usually your windshield would be cut by right through here. Well, all this added is flaring. So you can see where it's going right across where my hand grips and stuff are. That's all flaring. Which, what caused is my, my uh, turn signals right here originally are mounted had to go behind the screen but way up here and I couldn't get it on 
because this brace here to the windshield is supposed to be at the bottom most point of the triple tree but my uh, my lights turn signals were behind it so I had to move my turn signals uh, down just below the Christmas tree which it shouldn't sink that far and hit them but everything's works everything's together and that's that so catch you later